morning, December 9th, Daily Stoic. Spend thrift of time. Were all the genius of history to focus on this single theme, they could never fully express their bafflement at the darkness of the human mind. No person would give up even an inch of their estate. And the slightest dispute with a neighbor can mean hell to pay. Yet, we easily let others encroach on our lives. Worse, we often pave the way, pave the way for those who will take it over. No person hands out their money to passerby, but to how many do each of us hand out our lives? We are tight-fisted with the property and money, yet think too little of wasting time. The one thing about which we should all be the toughest misers. Seneca the Bereavity of Life 3.1-2 Today, there will be endless interruptions, phone calls, emails, visitors, unexpected events. Booker T. Washington observed that the number of people who stand today ready to consume one's time to no purpose. It's almost countless. A philosopher, on the other hand, knows that their default state should be one of reflection and inner awareness. This is why they so diligently protect their personal space and thought from the intrusion of the world. They know that a few minutes of Contemplation are worth more than any meeting or report. They also know how little time we are actually given in life and how quickly our stores can be depleted. Seneca reminds us that while we might be good at protecting our physical property, we are far too lax and enforcing our mental boundaries. Property can be regained. There's a quite a bit of out there. Some of it still untouched by man. But time, time is our most irreplaceable asset. We cannot buy more of it. We can only strive to waste as little as possible. Thank you. See you tomorrow.